Hi, welcome to my first ever Dutch oven cooking video. Today I'm going to be making Dutch oven baked Vidalia onions. I hope you enjoy. Start by first laying out a stick of butter so it can become room temperature. For this recipe, you're going to need your melted butter along with garlic, salt, pepper, mm -hmm. fresh preferably, and four Vidalia onions. Oh, and don't forget the parsley. I like the Italian kind. My wife won't let me play with knives, so I do this by hand. You'll see why here in a moment. Now take your spoon, uh -huh. and you're going to need about four or five cloves of garlic. Say that reminds me. No one ever uses one clove of garlic. The only recipe that calls for one clove of garlic is called How to Cook One Clove of Garlic. Make sure you get a good bit of garlic in there. You're going to want that flavor. Now add your salt and pepper. I like it a little heavy on the pepper side myself. Then add your stick of butter. This thing should be sitting at about room temperature by now. Now it's on my fingers. Always save the paper. We're going to use that in a minute. Now with a fork, give it a good stir. Get it all squished up. Stem, stupid stem. You can set that off to the side once you're finished with it. Now get your Dutch oven. Here's why I had you save the paper. This certainly isn't going to keep anything from sticking. The Dutch oven does that itself. I just hate to see butter get wasted. Now you're going to want to clean your onions. Now, remember how I told you my wife won't let me play with knives? Here's why. Bet you thought I was going to cut myself, didn't you? Alright, that's easy enough. You guys know how to clean an onion. Stick four of those onions into your Dutch oven. And be very generous with your garlic, butter, salt, pepper, and parsley mixture on top of each one. Squish it in real good. And then save the rest for later. Now would be a good time to go ahead and get your coals started. You need the coals for a 10 inch dove, a Dutch oven to achieve 350. Once you've done that, we're going to have six on the bottom. And about 14 or 15 on top. Now you're going to want to let this bake at 350 for about an hour and 15 minutes to an hour and a half, refreshing the coals after 45 minutes. As always, make sure you rotate your pot and your lid a quarter turn every 15 minutes. Now here's the finished product. 
Don't they look delicious? Ordinarily, I would brown the butter by leaving the lid off and putting all the top heat on the bottom. I highly suggest you do that. Brown butter is delicious. But for this video, I'm just going to scoop them out. And don't you even think about throwing away that butter. You'll see why here in a moment. So there you have it. Dutch oven baked Vidalia onions. Tonight, my wife made bacon wrapped barbecue sauce glazed pork chops with a tomato bake and corn on the cob and Brussels sprouts. Now, remember when I told you to save the butter? Corn on the cob, Brussels sprouts, dynamite. Well, please feel free to leave comments at the bottom of the page. This is my first video, so guys, please be gentle, okay? Hope you enjoy it. Bye-bye.